Hi, today I'm going to be reviewing the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream. And the full size of this is 1.6 ounces and it's $52. And unfortunately it comes in a jar, but thankfully I was able to get a smaller sample that's in a tube, not a jar. But uh, this is kind of a fun new cream. It just came out recently and it's got uh, a significant amount of hyaluronic acid in it. I believe it's about 30%. And I always wondered if hyaluronic acid is just this crazy miracle ingredient for skin, why don't more people use it in in a uh, greater concentration other than like one of the last few ingredients so this this company was able to come up with one that's got it uh, very high up on the list so um, and it's it's a very fun new cream I apologize if you hear any squeaks that's my puppy he is having fun playing with his squeaker toys right now but it's a very lightweight cream and once you apply it to your skin you just definitely feel how the hyaluronic acid is pulling the water molecules out and uh, attaching them to your skin. Now the only thing I would say is if you have extremely dry skin you'd probably want to use this under a thicker moisturizer um, but if you have normal or oily skin this might be enough for you but once you apply it you can instantly feel your skin kind of cooling down and getting more moisturized Hyaluronic acid pulls all the moisture from the air and attaches it to whatever the hyaluronic acid is on. So it definitely has a great feel, keeping it, uh, keeping your skin moisturized. And uh, I'm definitely going to be thinking about purchasing it in the full size. Unfortunately, it comes in a jar. Not a big fan of jars because especially items like hy hyaluronic acid will break down when it's exposed to oxygen. So. I'm going to savor this little sample, but uh, I'm interested if you guys have been able to try this at all yet. Leave me a comment and let me know. And then also I come out with at least one new review every day. So, And then with this cream, you can definitely use it in the morning or at night. But again, if you've got dry skin, you're going to want to use something else over or under it. So, um, But anyway, I give it two thumbs up. Thank you guys.